big build is moving right along and this is a big week for the project. The old bridges right here are coming down and the new bridges are starting to go up this week. Now the, de the demolition started back in January and it's almost complete. There are still some pieces of the old bridges still standing here in the downtown area, but Aldot expects to wrap up with the demolition by the end of the month. Meanwhile, while the demolition wraps up, construction on the new bridges expected to start this week. Back here on the ground, you can see this nearly one mile stretch of roadway that's closed. Just a big pile of dirt where the interstate once stood right here. But starting this week, crews are going to be out here to begin erecting the new bridges. Now the demolition again, as I mentioned, expected to wrap up by the end of this month and this entire project, the entire big build expected to be complete this time next year. So we still have another year left on the, of this chaos down here in the downtown area. Now Aldot is they do have some detours set up to help guide you around here. There's a lot of signage up to help guide you around these de, uh, around these closures here in the area, but they are asking that if you can use I 459 and just avoid this area altogether, do so.